Hello, friends and fellow space pilots. We're going to do, I think, a single episode probably here of a game I've been playing a lot of lately, uh, Chippy. I've been playing this just for fun. It is a delightful little space shoot 'em up And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to start at the beginning and go through. And it's a good way I can actually talk when it's not, uh, hasn't gotten completely loony. So like your usual, uh, your space shoot 'em up you've got some uh, enemies here. Uh, and usually when you get the option to do something, it comes with a, uh, a choice. You can either take a buff to get rid of a boss, or you can um, level up and get better firepower or something. But they, oh, you know, as these costs or these choices come, they always come with a uh, some sort of cost. So so far, I've taken a couple of buffs to see if we can just like plow through this thing ultra fast. Uh, this is it's got to be one of my favorite of this genre, although it is really hard. Or at least I found it. Oh, I still gotta get rid of these things. Oops. I'm totally wasting time. It's like, why is this not clearing? Uh, it's because I'm not hitting anything. Now, as you can see, I'm, I'm so far just trying to do this thing without basically any shield, because I thought, you know what? And I love, it gives you a hint. It's like, hey, you, let's grab a shield, because on the next level we'll need a shield. So now we can do damage and we'll just wipe this thing out. So it's not too egregious, there's not too many effects, there's a few big things that come at you in the first one here. There you go. Okay, let's grab that other shield. I don't even know what that other thing is. And we want to now get rid of these things. So you're trying to find this like path of least resistance, like how do I get rid of this thing? You gotta clear out these, uh, these other levels. So every level has a kind of optimization that you're gonna find. Trial and error, I, I could use those over multiple repeated plays here. I don't know what I'm even trying to do. I should be cutting through to a steeper angle. So basically I want to cut through this thing and release the this. And I could have definitely used the uh, the other buff. Uh, let's go around, kind of guide that thing away. This thing's gonna get in our way now. Okay, let's take, I don't even know. Let's take the power up. I'm not even sure what the other thing is. Sometimes I don't use, there's certain power-ups I don't like using, like dash. I find that to be a nightmare to use. I end up getting myself killed more often than not. Uh, I'll take a cannon. That's always good. And it, basically, uh, beyond just the difficulty of doing this, um, it's the difficulty of trying to do it faster than you did it before. So that's kind of the challenge. So where do we want to be? Where do we want to be? I don't know if this is there a good place to be. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna go over here. I think this is gonna be a good place. I'm gonna shoot some cannons at this thing. Clear out an area, and let's just get blasting. So, we have a little bit extra firepower, which helps with the number of hits you're doing. I think it all adds up. Okay, so we got that stage complete. Uh, let's go to the main menu. I don't think we did any better than previous. So our top our top was 2 minutes 31 seconds. Let's head into the next one. So it increasingly uh there on all the other ones are locked when you start. So you, it does force you to kind of progress through. So you're basically looking for like optimized ways of getting through each of these stages. But there's the little the challenges differ each time you go uh every level. So there's like this one there's these bubbles that kind of push you into the chaos that you don't want because you don't want to get pushed into something arbitrarily. Yeah, I will definitely take the power up and let's get rid of this final. So you're looking for these tiny little weak points so that you can sort of maximize uh, your firepower on this thing. I could have almost waited till the ending to get that. And then you dig your way through. I'm not so worried about the bubbles right at the moment. We just want to get rid of this thing as fast as possible before that, before this thing explodes and becomes a problem. <laughs> Okay, there we go. Let's grab a shield. I don't know what the other thing is. And another thing comes into place. All right, same deal. Let's cut off the limbs. Now, every once in a while, a good bonus like that comes across, but there's always a reward. There's always a catch. And it usually means some kind of uh, unpleasant thing will happen that I'm like, ah, that you don't necessarily want uh, to take that trade off. I typically don't. I think on these early ones, if I was to play through again, like just without talking, I would probably consider it uh, just to get my time up. But with the way it is right now, no. Oh, 
What I, it's funny is that I, I normally love playing super relaxing games, but believe it or not, if I'm going to just play a game for me to relax, this is one of my favorite genres to play to because they're, oh, what do we got? Cannons it is one of the most absurdly overwhelming genres I find. Let's get rid of some of that armor. Oh, good. Except they're not really hitting where I want, but. Whoa. There we go. Now let's do some damage. Oh, hello. Wow, I walked into that one. I should have warmed up. And we're almost there. There we go. Beautiful. I'll take the shield again. Now we've got some little boss baddies on the side here. Let's just... Maybe we'll get rid of one of these. Uh, we'll take the cannon. You sure? And then, again, looking for these weak points. Oh, another shield. That's good. I passed the other one up. Whoa. Oh, oh, that's the thing firing below. It's like, what is firing at me? Well, these things can be kind of... Uh, they are super anxiety-inducing. They're also kind of like... There's a zone you get into playing them, I find. I will lose like an hour playing one of these games. And it's it's the old mantra, fail again, fail better. Like, you're going to do badly at these things, I find. The first few times I play any, any given one... Um, I'll do terrible because you're learning. You're learning the uh, what kind of things it's going to throw at you. What are the curveballs? How close can I get to various things before I get wiped out? Those sorts of things. That's always fun. But I think as long as you come at it with the I'm going to do terrible at this for the first while, it's not such a onerous thing to to just go through that kind of pressure cooker of this. I don't know. There's again something very fun about that. As I've said before, when I've played uh, shmups, this is the kind of games I think I, I grew up in the arcade era, so I grew up playing these kinds of games, and I have an association probably with them that is more about, you know, them being, that, that's a terrible place, I don't want to be there, I want to go maybe over here. Okay, I've got, still I've got some cannons, whoa, as I push myself into things, whoa, frenzy, I don't want to hit those bubbles, that's not a good time for bubbles. You want a bubble bath now and again, but now's not the time. Whoa. Alright, let's get through this. I don't see... Again, I should not really be worrying about this little guy here. He's just annoying more than anything. Okay, let's take that cannon. Oh, I'm still missing one. That's the problem. Okay, let's... We gotta bust some bubbles here to get through. I did not notice I was missing this one. Whoa, frenzy. This one is fun. Oh, yikes. I think when I was playing, uh, in Stardew, I was playing uh, Prairie King the other day, and I was talking about that idea. I, again, I, I cut so much of it, I can't remember what stayed. But the idea that, um, let's put, let's go around here, and we're going to launch, we're going to set a turret up. Because we've got a, kind of, we've made a hole here. Oh, no, I should maybe try to focus my turret. Um, uh, is it hitting? I'm doing zero damage. Oh, why? Oh, because I have to get rid of this other thing. Oh, my bad. I should be paying attention. Hmm. Okay, I'll take that other turret. Brother, uh, okay, let's bump this thing down a bit. There you go. No, no, a little bit more. A little bit more. Whoa. Don't, don't hit me. What'd I do to you? And now it's just going bazonker because it's, it's frustrated. There we go. Stage complete. Again, I don't think that was my best. No. Let's hit the next one. Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't recall what I was saying. Bazumbo Prairie King. Uh, oh, yeah, you, you do... One thing you get accustomed to, I think, in all of these, where exactly the hitboxes and stuff are, like how precision do you have to be? Like, are we dealing with very, very, you know, pixel perfect? In this case, yes, and there's almost a bit of grace in this one as well, I think, around some of the projectiles. Uh, I feel like I'm going to probably get hit there, yeah. I was trying to be uh, clever, I don't want that, and get over here because I'm going to just try and knock this whole piece off without getting rid of the intermediary bits. There we go, and then I'm going to get in here and let's fire away at this. That thing wants to get me. There we go. Let's get rid of that, let's take the cannon. 
and let's just start doing damage. Now some of these, you just kind of hold your ground and accept that. That wants to... Now I'll take these power-ups for sure. Increase damage? Absolutely. Whoa. Okay, that was nice. Take a shield. Let's get out of the way. Okay, now this one. <laughs> You're trying to find all these points. I'm like, where are all the points on this one? There's so many, like, joints in this. And they move. Uh, whoa. Okay, that I... Not sure how I want to do. I guess you need to repel or something. What? Let's go around here. While I'm waiting, I'm gonna blast a hole through that. And the first while I played this game, because uh, somebody was in the room doing something, or for some reason, I had sound off for the first quite a while. Uh, I really like the music in this game. I think it completely suits the aesthetic and suits the whole feeling of the game. Um, it's interesting having played so much of it without the sound on. I actually found I played better with the sound on. Uh, some some games, you know, you want to concentrate. This one, I was like, no, it actually adds to the whole, uh, the frenetic kind of feel of the thing. Okay, what am I doing now? Where do we want to go? Oh, I've got some I'm missing on that one. <laughs> oh, yeah, you fire uh, horrible stuff. I don't care for that. What am I missing on this one? I don't even know. Let's get the shield. Oh, I don't have a shield. That would be good. I could totally use a shield. Throw me one of those. And some of these are kind of tricky to get. Again, I don't know if I'm going... Whoa, I don't like those. No, no, I keep those. You can have them. I, I didn't want them. Okay. Come on. Ah. <laughs> I'd like to get through here. Okay. Like one more hit on this thing. There we go. Oh, I want the damage up. Yes, please. Okay. Okay, now I'll take more damage up. I don't even know what, I'm, what kind of damage I'm doing now. Uh, okay, I, again, I'm not even... This level I haven't defeated a lot of times. I'm not even sure what I'm... Oh, yeah, okay, there. Whoa! Hot pajamas. Oh, that wasn't good. We'll see. We might not survive this one. Oh, no. That was... See, I walked right into that. Okay, let's hit, hit this one again. Uh, all right, let's pick a path. I'm going to come back over here. Oh, right, we have to start back at this one. Uh, okay, which do I want to go with? Well, yeah, I think I'm just going to go around here and get rid of this laser first, so it's not in my way. I don't accidentally stumble into it. I'll take a shield. Uh, I think that the one thing I really like that this, this one's added to the, the, you know, every good version of a shmup seems to add something really good to the uh, kind of the canon of shmups. And this one, uh, the whole idea of chiseling away your boss, I don't know if it's been done before. Um... I've never played one quite like this. I I think that's the satisfaction, is it like you're... It's like breaking apart Lego or something. I'm going to take all these damages. Again, I don't know how many of these roll over to the next boss, or if we forfeit. I've never quite paid enough attention to figure it out. Let's try here and maybe see. Okay, now we're back at this thing. Okay, so... You get this like nice little grace period. Now that this one, I can I actually do frontal damage on it? No, I can't. Okay. Uh, okay, I just walk around the other way. That's fine. <laughs> yeah, I don't like the way they, uh, they come at me. No, no, leave me alone. Whoa, wah. Those ones are like so slow almost that it's... Okay, and you, let's... And again, because I'm not, I'm, I'm seldom looking directly at stuff. Sometimes you realize you're not firing exactly where you want to. I find I just have to look with my peripheral vision because there's so much going on that if I actually stare directly at something, I'm going to miss the other thing flying at me. Like I could have got that damage up, but oh, these things are annoying. Oh my gosh. Do do. Okay, let's zip on through here. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Whoa. Hello. 
There we go. Let's bust this thing off. Let's get rid of this. Pass on through that. Just saying hello. Okay. What am I oh, I'm missing a part way deep in there? There's so many things to chisel off on this one. Whoa. They're not, uh, they're rather slow moving though, this one. I, I'll give it that. See, I guess I could just come in at this, but then I can't get that without getting this. So that's what I find is I'm here. I like, I'm trying to not look too closely at the little pieces because I'm trying so hard to get the other little pieces that, uh, and now I want to get rid of, you see, I, you could, I think if you go for like, you got to get rid of some of these anyway. So if you go for them to start with, you're better off than just going for these small ones, but they're slightly harder to get. There we go. That getting rid of that chunk helps. Okay. Uh, let's fly through the middle of this chaos now. Let's cut through this. I don't know what this is going to do for me, but it can't be bad. I can't get that yet. Okay, and let's cut through this. Okay, and then we can just come at this right here. I don't, again, I'm, I'm trying to not pay enough attention to figure out what exactly that's going to do. Okay, that allows me to get at this, which will cut off these two. Oh, this is a good way to do this one. I'll take the power up, thanks. And I know there's one here. Again, I'm just trying to loosely fire at it without looking at it too close. Staring at the sun. No, okay, there's... Oh, right, we've got a hinge on the other side. <laughs> it's like disassembling stuff. Taking apart a typewriter and trying to figure out how to put it back together again. Oh. That's not just a reference because I'm old. It's, it's, it's a thing I like doing. That is... Uh, fun taking apart mechanical objects and then trying to uh, reassemble them. Hoping that you've remembered all the bits. Okay, what do I want to get rid of? In amidst this carnival of doom here, let's... Uh... Okay, like, do we want to get rid of... I don't have to get rid of that, I don't think. It's just annoying more than anything. Okay, this is going to close in on me. Let's maybe move. Okay, let's put a hole through the side of this. I feel like we, we're we going to need to... It's a lot of stuff now. Uh, I, yeah, I felt like it was kind of inevitable I was going to lose the shield there. This thing I want to get rid of because it's actually going to blow up and spew horribleness. Uh, there we go. Oh, that's not good. No, nope, we definitely needed uh, the shield there. There we go. Oh, I wish they'd given me a shield. I could have definitely used one of those. Okay, I may take this thing out because this thing might give me a shield. Ah, uh, yes, it will. I will take it. Thank you. And some of these, it's like you, you're you trying to get uh, rid of... I should have went to the right, not the left. I'm trying to get rid of the weirdest little segments. Um... But it's like, what's the quickest, easiest path to blast your way through these little pixels? Voxels? Pixels? No, there must be pixels. Okay, now this thing's gonna... Now it can do damage. And now I can... I'm gonna use the cannon, I guess, here in a second. That's all I have. I have one. Oh, okay. <laughs> I feel like things are gonna get crazy. Yeah, I could definitely use the shield. Whoa. 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 Yeah, okay. And this gets a bit funky. This is where you're like, I should have gotten rid of the other little bosses on the side. Ah, no, no, no. We want that. We want the shield. Ooh, yee, 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 yee. Oh, wow. Genuinely sweating. Genuinely sweating there. Holy cow. Okay. <laughs> that was a toughie. I think my thumb just fell off. Still, I don't think I beat my personal best. Uh, so I think let's jump. We'll jump over this one, I think. Let's jump to this one for a little bit. You can see it kind of, there's an evolution of the bosses and the baddies and stuff. This one I still haven't beat. This one is, has, uh, it took me quite a while to get past even this first stage. 
Oh, no. See, th those things are dreadful. They, they grab you if you bump into them and it hooks you. Now, these things come and you can kind of, you can go into the middle of it, but it's a trade-off. Do you want to do that? Okay, this same deal. Uh, yeah, well, that. <laughs> and this one regrows. So this is problematic. Uh, I'm going to take freeze. You're trying to... I don't want that. That one brings badness. You, you're like, yay, more power. And boo, also, this is horrifying. I'm going to take the shield here. Because there's a shield that appears there. Okay, that was good. That worked out well. Uh, okay, let's take the cannon. Let's go up and get the shield. This one, I feel like you really do have to get on it quite quick. Because if you wait too much on some of these with the regrow, it really dooms you. Oh, and I, I got it, but it hurt my shield. Uh, see, that one I should have just hung it out. Now this timer thing. I'm going to get rid of this. Because it's just annoying. And then we're going to get to we can take a cannon. Oh, I have to get rid of freeze first. Which is quite handy on some of these. Like this mess. I guess you just hold it and then... Uh, okay. Whoa. Okay, now let's blast through a bunch. Oh, I see it regrew. That thing is annoying right there. I wish you could get rid of these. Go away. Go away. Uh, yeah, let's do... Oh, come on. Let's see, it's going to... Uh, now we get these bubbles that form on this one. And you can get rid of them. And they explode. It's not a big deal. But they're a pain in the butt. Because they uh, they take up the whole map at some point. The whole screen. Uh, okay, that bounced off that. They And they kind of follow you. So you want to, I guess, lead them in one direction. There's probably a trick to doing it. I haven't figured it out yet. You can see they, they kind of blast with a slow, you know, it's not a big deal. But it completely hoops up your oh, your strategy of like taking these things on, and then this gets a little crazy. Ah, uh, yeah, I've lost my shield. This might be the enemy. Whoa. Okay. See, I'm kind of lost focus now, and with the all of these things here, I feel like this is probably a doomed run. Ah, yep. Yeah. Oh, we have another shield? Wow. I shielded up really well this time. Nope, that was us. What I'll do, uh, let's go back to the main menu. You can see that one's br <laughs> it's brutal. Um, down here, I don't understand the difference between these. Um, there's about seven layers or something on that one. And then there's these, which are a, a totally different beast, which I've never even completed the first one. So let's just take a quick peek at it. So this... You can kind of, you got to work through this whole thing. Uh, but as soon as you do, you release these horrible, like, dragon things that follow you everywhere. So I've, my strategy has been to sort of uh, avoid them by not unlocking them right away. Okay, let's give it another go. That was a, a poor run to start with. Let's, let's unlock it just to show what uh, it does. So you're like, yay, we got a shield. Let's get a shield. But then it'll be, boo, this thing's going to now follow me. And it can kind of catch up with you. So you kind of are trying to do circles, but also not get... It's, it creates... Like, you're, you've created your own nightmare, is what you've done. So it's like, did I want that, really? <laughs> so my strategy was to not cut all the way through the things, to basically do part of the work. Oh, that thing's going to appear. There we go. And they go away after a little bit. But by that point... I'm already going with like door number two here. Okay, let's take out these these deflector shield things. I don't even know what they are. And it's it's taken a bit of a breather on me. Oh now now it's back. <laughs> oh, why did I run right into that? That was a silly thing. But I would say with the just the overall like the variety of what uh, 
Let's get the shield because I'm going to need it. With the variety of what Chippy does, um, the just the the variance in all of these levels. There's some brilliant level design here from for this genre. I, I'm really I'm continually stunned by the weird things it throws at me, which is amazing. I think that's what's kept me going. Whoa, we're gonna stop there. I have played like I don't know ten hours plus, and I have not yet kind of gotten bored or just thought, hey, I've got this licked. Um, it's not just the global, like, I think once you get really good at it, the global leaderboards is a nice little uh, icing on the cake. But it is a very, f I don't know, it's frenetic, it's fun, it's got a lot of variation. Um, even within the simple concept that it has of just chiseling away at these big bosses. And I, yeah, there's, uh, I think it's, we'll just take a brief look at this one. Because I think this shows a yet another level of variation. So th you got this thing where you're just chiseling at this, and then these other bosses come at you. This one is one of those ones where I was like, "What? What is this?" You can then take these things out, and uh, you know you'll get your goodies from these guys. Okay, let's grab a shield, and we'll just keep plowing away at this thing. And at some point, we you know do enough damage to make it uh, worthwhile, but. And you can go at the, these things from both directions. The front is like the warhead, it seems like. The back, it just is harder to get. Okay, oh, now I will go. I was looking at this shield. You know what, we're gonna take the power up. And we'll get the shield here. And those dizzy things will literally just make you dizzy. Oh, I didn't want slow-mo. And they kind of stink. Because if you get one, it'll drive you like into a wall. <laughs> And I don't know, my the way I got past this one the first time, I think it was just a matter of uh, um, kind of ignoring these little things and just focusing on this big boss. But at the same time, it's really hard to do at a certain point because the whole screen goes bananas and it's more luck than anything, I think, that approach. So, I don't know. But this one, uh, in terms of oh, sheer dodging, this one was a lot of fun. But uh, the constraints base of it, it, it played very different. I thought, well, that's brilliant. Like, that's... Oh, come on. Get over here. Oh, no. Over here. Over here more. Oh, see, they just took my things out. That's not fun. We lost, whoa, all the advantage we had there. Okay, I would like that shield. That would be really sweet. Thank you. I don't know if getting rid of the nose cone on this thing is even just an advantage, like just doing that maybe is good. Uh, I'll take the power up. Damage plus two, sure. And the <laughs> the multiple layers of that, and then also the those dizzy things, because if you get that, you're hooped. You'll definitely just drive into everything. And sometimes it's kind of hard to recover. Now they're clustered over there, so I'm just going to focus on this. But, as soon as I break through this thing, it gets all banane -y. It just goes absolutely wild on you. Whoa, can we get to it? Be fun. Oh, that was dumb. I just walked right into that. Okay, let's take this, because I don't have a shield. Definitely like a shield. Shields would be good. Shields are like, they're uh, underrated. Definitely underrated. Oh. There we go. Now the craziness begins. Everyone just goes like. Oh, they go all the way. And this one is. Okay, I'm going to go up here. Uh, can we get through? Can we get through? Yes, we can. We might have a chance. So I'm now just focusing my efforts actually on the thing and not on these. These baddies can go away. Okay, I'm not even sure how I, what the math, how I want to approach this. I 
I did not think I'd actually get through any levels while talking, doing this. Maybe, maybe I've just played enough of it at this point. See, what, 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 what? Why are you doing this to me? Oh my gosh, now I'm confused. That wasn't good. I don't like the confused. No, no, no. And I was trapped in the ships. I got stuck between them. Well, that was us. That was fun. At any rate, uh, go if you like this at all, the genre. Uh, this is definitely one of the finest I have played. And uh, I don't know. More people should play it. It's so much fun. At any rate, I hope you enjoyed and see you all next time. Till then, bye-bye.